Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, trapezoid uh, A, B, F, A, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that uh, these three sides, uh, A, B, C, D, and E, F are parallel to each other. And moreover, uh, this uh, side uh, A, B is uh, 13 units. This side uh, E, F is uh, 4 units. This segment uh, EC is 3 units. And finally, this uh, segment uh, AC is uh, 6 uh, units. And furthermore, uh, this angle uh, BAC is uh, 60 degrees. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded region. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's recall the definition of a trapezoid. Sometimes we call it uh, trapezium. A quadrilateral with at least uh, one pair of parallel sides. And here we can see this uh, green shaded region is a trapezoid. Since uh, this uh, side uh, CD is parallel to this uh, side EF. And now let's recall the area of a trapezoid formula. Area equals to height h times a plus b all over 2. And now we can see this side is our a, this side is our b, and uh, this uh, is the height uh, h of this uh, green trapezoid. And now we can find the area of this uh, green trapezoid if we can find the value of this side uh, a, this height uh, h, and we know our B value is 4. And now we are going to think uh, outside the box. And we are going to draw some auxiliary lines. As you can see in this uh, next step, I have drawn this uh, line uh, EK that is parallel to this other line uh, FB. And this uh, line uh, EK passes through this point uh, T. And now let's make an observation since these two lines EK and FB are parallel to each other. So therefore we conclude that this uh, EF length is going to be equal to this uh, TD length. If this length is 4 then this uh, TD length is going to be 4 as well. And finally this is also going to be equal to KB length which is going to be 4 as well. And we know that this whole uh, side length uh, AB is 13 units. And this segment uh, KB is uh, 4. So therefore uh, this uh, remaining uh, segment AK is going to be 13 minus 4 is going to give us uh, 9 units. And now our task is uh, to calculate uh, this uh, CT length. And now we know that this angle is 60 degrees. Uh, so therefore this angle has got to be 60 degrees as well since uh, these are our corresponding uh, angles and they are congruent. And moreover if this angle is uh, alpha then this angle has got to be alpha as well. These are our corresponding uh, angles as well. So therefore we conclude that this uh, triangle uh, ECT and this uh, big uh, triangle uh, EAK are similar triangles according to angle angle similarity theorem. Since this angle is congruent to this angle, this angle is congruent to this angle as well. And finally, this uh, angle is common for both of these triangles. So therefore, we are going to have a proportion. In other words, the ratio of uh, EC and uh, EA let me go ahead and write down the ratio of uh, EC divided by EA is going to be equal to this uh, EC length uh, is uh, 3 and this whole uh, EA length is going to be 3 plus 6 is going to give us uh, 9 units. So therefore we can write this one as 3 divided by 9. And here we can see 3 and 9 reduces to 1 divided by 3. As you can see in this uh, next step, we can see their ratio is going to be 1 and 3. So therefore we conclude the ratio of uh, this uh, segment CT and this uh, segment uh, AK is going to be 1 to 3 as well. 
in other words if this uh, segment is uh, 1 then this segment has got to be 3 and now we can see that this segment is 9 units so this uh, one third of this 9 is going to give us uh, 3 units in other words our CT length is going to be one third of uh, 9 is going to be equal to 3 units and now let's make an observation we can see that uh, this uh, segment CT is 3 and this segment uh, TD is uh, 4 so therefore this whole uh, side uh, CD is going to be 3 plus 4 is going to give us uh, 7 units so thus we figured out uh, our this uh, side of the screen uh, trapezoid as uh, 7 units and now our next step is to calculate the height uh, h of the screen trapezoid and here's our next step i have dropped this uh, perpendicular ep on this side uh, cd as you can see let me label uh, this perpendicular as our height uh, h and now let's recall the trig ratio sine of theta is always equal to opposite divided by hypotenuse and in our case our angle theta is 60 degrees our opposite side is h and our hypotenuse is 3 so therefore our sine of 60 degrees is going to be equal to h divided by 3 and now we can see sine of 60 degrees is square root of 3 divided by 2 so therefore I'm going to substitute uh, over here square root of 3 divided by 2 so therefore we can write uh, square root of 3 divided by 2 equals to h divided by 3 and now I'm going to multiply by 3 on both sides to isolate uh, h and here we can see 3 and 3 is gone so therefore our height uh, h turns out to be 3 times the uh, square root of 3 divided by 2 units so thus this uh, height uh, h uh, of the screen trapezoid turns out to be 3 times square root of 3 divided by 2 and now let's recall once again the area of a trapezoid formula area equals to height h uh, times a plus b all over 2 and here in our case uh, our a value is 7 b value is 4 and our height h value is 3 times square root of 3 divided by 2 so therefore the area of this uh, green uh, trapezoid is going to be equal to let me go ahead and write down uh, height uh, h is 3 times square root of uh, 3 divided by 2 times our a value is 7 plus uh, b value is 4 divided by 2 and here we can see 7 plus 4 is going to give us uh, 11 so therefore we can write uh, this one 3 times square root of 3 divided by 2 times 11 divided by 2 and if we multiply the top and the bottom that is going to give us uh, 33 times the square root of 3 divided by 4 square units so thus the green shaded region area turns out to be 33 times square root of 3 divided by 4 square units and that is going to be approximately equal to 14.29 square units as well and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye